Greetings gamers and also movie fans! Today the Morbius trailer dropped and we did a quick reaction to it over on Joven Shire's Instagram but we wanted to do like a full trailer reaction. So we're gonna watch the entire trailer and then uh, kind of react to it. We won't pause at all and then we'll discuss afterwards and maybe go back to some specific parts. Go! Alright, here we go! Oh, he's looking ripped! It's the whole uh, 15 seconds thing before the, the trailer. Right! So that wasn't the actual the trailer. Yeah. All right. All right. Do you think Morpheus will show up in this video? Uh, no. Why would he? Oh, I meant to say Neo. I butchered my joke. Oh, Mor Morbius, Morpheus? Yeah. Oh, it's the, was that the guy from Chernobyl? I don't know, but that's the guy from um, Batman. Suicide Squad? That one too. <laughs> in association with Marvel, which has me a little excited. Does that mean it's MCU? Well, it means that it's... Marvel looked over it and said, this is okay. But anything that's in the Marvel universe has that. Blood disease. Oh I'm man, he's, his time. spine is not looking in great shape. No. Neither is that bad. No. Alright. Interesting. Now, as I understand it, his body's not... Oh, he has a bad blood disease. Right. So he's using bat DNA to fix it. Much like Dr. Connor's lizard used Lizard DNA. Right. This is a very unscientific approach to fixing a disease though. Yeah. It's like, let me cut my hand open and, and, and summon and bats. By the way, Batman can summon bats in the in Batman Begins. Yeah, using a microchip, not his blood though. I don't know if you remember that, but it was terrible. <laughs> it was great! Because it was an ultrasonic wave! It was a cool moment. Oh, look at him. He's strong. He can break glass with his fists now. Yeah. Ooh. From the people who brought you Spider-Man Homecoming. Yeah! And far from home. And Venom. And Venom. What's happening? Again, I, wonder if it's, it's, I feel like it's the same CGI bass from Batman. I feel like more alive than I Oh, there it is. See, there, yeah, look at that. He's so strong. He can catch Orbeez. Does he got teleport Why? power? I don't remember that in the... Why was the orb, like, smoking like that? Ooh, Scarlet Witch, I can assume. I like the way the visual, visualization of his abilities is cool. Oh yeah, like, okay, that's kind of his uh, echo, echo location. Yeah. How far are we allowed to go? There's, There's the, a Spider-Man symbol the in the back. Oh wait, did we just pass that? Yeah, okay, that we'll was the murderer. There. there was something written on the chalkboard behind him too, I wonder if that's important. Until the remedy. She's walking upside down like a bat, I get it. Is worse okay, so she's disease. evil? No. But that, I think that looks good. Yeah. I think that looks the best that Morbius could look in a live action movie. That that did look good. Michael Morbius. Got tired of doing the whole good guy thing, huh? What's up, Doc? Hey, the Vulture! Hey, it's Michael Keaton as the Vulture okay, again! So we saw we saw lights behind uh, him. So like cop lights, does that mean he's out of like why would there be police siren lights in jail? It, 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 Let's go show back. Us, here. Show us that clip again there. So there, there are there are siren lights, lights behind him. There's some sort of it looks like a car here. Yeah. So it looks like he's escaped at least, right? Yeah, but what is he wearing in this it, particular? It, I outfit? thought it was a lab coat. You said so. That's you said this was the jumpsuit that they wore. Let's go real quick to the the Spider-Man Far From Home end scene. Oh yeah. So yeah, it's the same outfit. It's the exact same outfit. Wow. Yeah, it's even got the with the gray thing, thing yeah. underneath. Yeah. So that has to be him. There's Scorpion. I didn't notice Scorpion had those things on him before. Okay, so it's like 100% him. Yeah. So wasn't Kevin Fahey very much against, though, like the Venom, like the spinoff characters being connected to the... But then there was the, the whole thing with... Uh, to with, the MCU. With Marvel fighting over the rights with Sony over Spider-Man, and so... And then Tom Hiddleston drunkenly called yes. Fahey and begged for it. For so I wonder if maybe some of these are reshoots. If this character is the same character, because that char this character is technically exists in the MCU. Yes. The but Vulture exists in the in MCU. Front of a... Because uh, he's escaped and he's putting together the Sinister Six, right? Yeah, but why is there a cop there? Where's the cop? The sirens. The cop Those car. are red, blue... Maybe he stole the cop car to escape. Oh, and he made it to... That's how he did his breakout. See, normally when you have a moment like this and you're putting together Sinister Six, that's a post credit scene. I swear to God, if yeah. they just showed us if a If they showed us the scene. post credit scene, yeah, they are not taking notes correctly from Marvel. Well, here's the thing is they want people to know going in. Well, yeah, they're talking about it. We're MCU. talking about it. Yeah. The po Actually, you know who might be in the post credit scene is Venom. I wouldn't be surprised if Venom shows up post credits. Venom still has to fight Carnage, too. That's the thing. Venom that's fights Carnage. 
but also shows up post credits in this. Yeah, well, that's Venom 2, which is, I think, already in production. Correct me if I'm wrong. Yeah, I, I think so. By the way, do you think this trailer gives too much away? I kind of do. <laughs> if they do the standard three-act superhero origin movie, I think we've seen a little of everything. So I'm pretty sure right here, uh, this like that whole submarine scene uh -huh. is going to be like the act two. He has his powers, and this is the first time we're really seeing him in action. Because yeah. when you see him do the leap, yeah. it doesn't look like he's in Morbius yeah, it's, uh, it's, shape yet. It's, it's Venom beating up SWAT guys. Yeah, thing, right? literally. Oh, okay, here we go. So, Murder, so that's the Sam Raimi suit, yeah? That, so it is the Sam Raimi suit. And it is from PS4, so that technically isn't a photo. Like someone's not taking pictures of Spider-Man swinging what is around. This heart onion thing. Uh, or heart something question mark. Heart ooh ooh That's not good. <laughs> but as you can see here, uh, he's wearing an orange, orange jump. Yeah. So suit. he gets he gets caught at some point in this movie too. And you'd imagine, is that when he meets Vulture? So maybe it's not a post credit scene. Maybe him going to jail and Vulture breaking him out is part of the movie. Interesting. Yeah. I don't, yeah, I don't think they showed us a post credit scene. I think what they showed us was... Oh, oh wait, wait, oh, wait. Who's, who's the guy with guy? the arm? Yeah, we didn't... Even, I didn't even see this guy's arm. F***ing Jax here. Interesting. Yeah, it's not Shocker. No, so, yeah. someone who knows more about the uh, comics could probably chime in there. So my worry, and I kind of talked about this a little bit in, in, our, in the Instagram video, is uh, when you have a lot of different superhero movies, not just Sony, not just Marvel, but uh, the plot is always, hey, I'm the boss, I'm the friend, I'm the businessman, I'm the partner that just wants your, your powers and I'm going to use it against you. Iron Man did it, Ant-Man did it, uh, Venom did it, right. uh, The Mask did it. It's always the same thing when you have your, uh, your, your superhero movie. Right, so you're hoping they do something different Just here. something a little bit different, but I, I, just want, I don't want to see Morbius fighting another generic vampire at how, the end of the movie. How could they switch it up, though? I don't know. I don't know who uh, other Morbius bad guys could be. Yeah, yeah. There's got to be a way to switch up the origin story. Yeah, but I think... Ooh, there it is. Uh, I like how he I looks. I think he looks good. He's got the sissy spacek nose. Yeah, I don't think Morbius is going to be the movie to switch it up. But <laughs> yeah, probably not. It's but probably we'll see. not. We'll see when we go in. Um, overall, it looks cool. Uh, we talked a little bit on, on your channel. Vulture obviously building the Sinister Six, uh, which will be Mor Morbius Vulture. I have to imagine Doc Ock will get in there somewhere. Doc Ock makes sense. Maybe but Doc Ock, well, no, Doc Ock doesn't exist in the MCU. Not, yeah, none of that exists in the MCU. Here's my question. Will it be Venom or Carnage? You can't have both of them in a Sinister Six. Carnage wouldn't other. be in, in... I don't think yeah, Carnage has too, ever been in Sinister Yeah, he's too mayhem. Six, yeah. So, but Venom's a good guy. They might switch it up. Here's Venom's the thing. Venom, Venom oh. is anti-hero, but leaning very good guy in this movie. What if Venom 3... The third, so Venom 2, he fights Carnage. Venom 3 is him teaming up with Spider-Man to fight the Sinister Six. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Well, here's the thing is, here's what I would love to see, and here's what I think the way they're setting it up they could do. I almost think Spider-Man realizes he's outnumbered and needs to put a team together, but for whatever reason, the Avengers are out. So, like, uh, Sinister Six versus, like, Spider-Man, Venom, Blade... Yeah, that's right. Yeah. You want to see Blade in this because yeah. Blade should be going Blade, up against Morbius. Hunting, hunting a vampire, yeah. And if this is an association with Marvel and it does exist in the MCU, Blade will be getting his own MCU movie in a while and it would line up and make sense that then Blade goes from the MCU into the Sony-verse. Yeah. My theory is that Tom Hiddleston has brokered some sort of mastermind deal through crying phone calls that now has the Sony universe integrated and I'm completely very much into okay the with MCU. That. Yeah. If that's what Tom pulled off, I guess I guess we'll have to see. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Tell us what you think in the comments. We'd love to see your thoughts on this movie. And if you if want to see more trailer bad. reactions like this, yeah, I'd be more than happy know. to come over and talk yeah, nerdy like let's this. let's do it. Talking nerdy. All right, uh, thanks for joining me, Joven. Be sure to check out Joven Shire's channel. Uh, there'll be a link in the description, and we'll see you all next time. Bye! Bye.